Hello everybody, Chris here, and in this short tutorial I'm going to be showing you how you can add a new Windows account to your Windows 10 PC. So this could be family members or just someone you want to give access to your PC without giving them your own personal account. So and the quickest way to do this is probably to go up to the start menu, which may be located in your bottom left hand corner. Uh, click to open that up and start typing add account which is going to search through the PC and find the system settings dialog for add, edit, or remove other users. That's what you want. So go ahead and click that. And uh, here you can add in family members or other users to the PC. You're either going to need a email that's associated as a Microsoft account or you can make a new one on the spot. Uh, but generally Windows 10 prefers that you sign in using Microsoft accounts. Um, it makes it easier for them to manage uh, basically information across different installations of Windows as you lock in on different computers, for instance. Uh, but in any case, moving on from that, um, you're going to need that email address, or you can alternatively hit, I don't have this person sign on information, uh, which will basically allow you to just create a new Microsoft account on the spot. So we're going to go ahead and do that here. Uh, let's go ahead and hit get a new email address just for this demo purposes, and we'll do Chris Tutorials maybe Chris tutorials at outlook.com okay cool it is available um, type in a password as normal country and date of birth okay once you've gone ahead and entered your date of birth hit next and you can add in security info which couldn't be a phone number uh, basically a way for recovering your account information or you can just use an alternate email so go ahead and Type in an email or add in your phone number and then you can hit next. Choose the settings that are related to you. Uh, send me promotional offers. I don't really need that. And enhance my online experiences. Well, that's up to you. I'll just disable it for right now. Hit next. And then at that point, uh, you have a new user added to this computer and at the same time following this tutorial you've created a new email address which you can actually log into and use. So that's essentially it for how to add a account to your Windows PC. Of course if you already have an email address that is associated with a Microsoft account you don't need to create a new email just use that in the proper fields when it asks you for instead. But aside from that, I've been Chris. Thank you very much for watching. I hope this helped, and I'll see you in my next video.